figures. Eh. Ano yung makikita natin? That's right. No last go will be going to the bench. The front line of Benilde here will be Katarig, Christy Ontangan, and Jade Hentapa. Again, Jade is the lone graduating player on the floor. See, Christy, of course, a veteran already. I think this is her third or fourth year. Fourth year, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, Micah is on her second playing year, third playing year. Micah? Oh. Third, no? Most probably third. Because no MVP year niya is not her rookie year. Oh, yeah. Third year. Uh, third year. Yeah. So she still has two more years to play. Does provided she... that she maximizes her eligibility. That's right. She started 95, she's in 95, 97, and then skipped 98 because of the ACL injury. The and third now playing year. 99. Yeah. Is the slide mm, that is sent back well read by JRU Hentapa scores. And for some time, Jade Hentapa, Hentapa was the number one attack mm. for the offense of the Lady Blazers. You know, I mean, this is uh, tactical when it comes to uh, Coach uh, Jerry's attack. On this. Kasi kailangan niya ng isang stabilizer. Kung baga sa, kung baga sa mga sa TGIS, may tagahatid eh, di ba? Sa TGIS. Oo, oh, di ba, Shara Soto? Kasi nanonood ako yesterday oh, eh, okay. mga, sa YouTube channel natin, okay. ng mga replays. So, sinitignan ko, ay, sinitignan sa batch ko yung may gato. Oh. So, ganun din, kailangan may veteran. <laughs> yeah. Sorry na, na segue na. TGIS. Sa lahat ng pwede mong panoorin, mong panoorin sa YouTube. My favorite, okay. bro. <laughs> That was a, that was a oh. great show. Oh, in the meantime, this is Lady Blazers. And it also speaks of the recruitment for both squads. Mm. Oh, I like the recruiting class dito ngayon ni Coach Mia. They, she has athletes. Yeah. Which year athletes na nakikita natin can be molded and developed. Yeah. Pinasok na ni Coach Mia itong si Janine Preta. Oh, ito rin si Shanine Preta. Younger sister ni Spencer Preta. Mm -hmm. who, used, uh, who used to be a player for LBU and, LBU and San Sebastian. San Sebastian no? yeah. Baka long range naman. scorer din siya down the line. Oh, ah, you know? Yun ang bread and butter oh. ni Spencer. Eh. Yun ang bread and butter na niya. Sneakers, you know? Sneakers ni Sally. Si, <laughs> si Spencer. Ayun na ba? Oh, oh. You know, oh, yeah, yeah. isa-isa mong mahilig niya ni Spencer. And I bet na nanonood siya transporting niya. For sure. Yeah. His sister. So... This is outside long ball. Para dito kay Preta. Now Jade will begin. May pinasok pang isa si Coach Mia. Si Cherish Dayami. There you go. Mm. Preta gets denied. Esto kay... Uh. Mm -hmm. Na baby lang masyado. Yung uh, drummers. Dinala siya ng kanyang inertia but not be able to get that power keep going to the other Serving side. And here, it's really the ball. Yeah. And when you get sets like that, especially, where is he going to win the card? He's hard to win this fight because he's efficient today. He's si winning this fight. Okay. Laurente, to the middle. A good hit. Get it, oh, JJ. Good hustle. Ball is still in play. Laurente. Combination for JRU. Oh. They're looking for a Attack check. None out. will be given. To the Yamen. Point goes to the Yamen. Oh, sa ilalim ng bola niya, napalo yun. Hindi ka natin dito. On the replay, trying to go for that combination. Tama na sa ilalim eh. Kaya kahit nakargahan niya, medyo palo mo po talaga. Arrive ng bola. Pero kasi hindi kumagat yung triple block. Dun sa dalawang diko yan, no? Mm-hmm. Too strong for Christy. Service goes out. So, 3 to 5. It's a closer match here in the early moments of Set number two, Shanine Preta will make Serving her way to the service line. She Preta, one of the six rookies, six including the reserve player, Netani Coach Mia. Underhand set up for Willin. Abantay si Ruiz. Here's the approach. Dayame couldn't convert. Katigan oh, to Katarig. Checked. Hentapa. And I chooses Dayami. Estoque will try again. Voila, good rally we're seeing so far. Dayami. Too strong. So Hasn't no adjusted on her attacks yet, coach. No lift yet on those hits. Tama ka, Martin. Hindi pa siya nakaka-adjust dito. Lalo na matataas yung mga sets. Kita mo, yung 
hindi pa bumababagaan yung bola. Pinapalo na niya agad. Instead of getting into her line of vision para pa-downhill yung palo niya. Kaya medyo palobo pa tatlong hits niya na nakita natin. I think the sheer height of the blockers oh. of Benilde is affecting her attempts. Sure, Bull. Diba? Where, where is Stoke? Oh, no, Willin Estoke scores again. So, fifth point. Fifth point of Estoke. She has been all business today. Para sa Benilde. As all means to her. As all means to her. Diba? Ganun sa kanila. Sila ni Doro. Kaya Doro. maganda si... Kasi uh, siguro dahil nakita rin natin talaga sa beach volley, we were, were able to see her perform na silang dalawa yung magka-tandem. And si Dorog kasi provides a lot of things that yeah. Mike Ago used to provide. Nung nahinug na siya ngayon, nakikita mo, nag, nagpo-protecta siya dun sa backline ng depensa nila. Uh, She goes east-west. Parang dalawa nga yung libero. <laughs> Maganda okay, dun siya sa likod. Last season, si, ito si Jessa Dorog was the primary receiver, strongest receiver na itong uh, Benio Lady Blazers. Maganda lagi first ball nila. Estoke. Good put that. Mm. Inday. Risked it. Hindi nang apuntos. Uy! Tapos na yung we, we, football we, we, finals. finals. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pero first, legal play yun. Legal play. Yeah. First technical timeout. 8 to 4 for Ben Neal. First technical timeout. After the break, again a report from Fatima Reyes. Bigong makapasok sa 2024 Paris Olympics si Tokyo Olympic gold medalist at Pinay weightlifter na si Haydalin Diaz. Hindi nakamit ni Diaz ang kailangang puntos sa 59kg weightlifting category sa qualification rounds ng 2024 IWF World Cup. Dagdag naman sa listahan ng pambato ng Pilipinas para sa Paris Olympics ang Pinay weightlifter na si Elrin Ando. Pinataob ni Ando si Diaz. We're back here in NCAA Season 99 Women's Volleyball Tournament. Let's talk a bit about how both of our teams shake off their jitters before the game. Alam niyo bang sobrang lakas na sound trip ang maririnig natin mula sa dugout ng Lady Blazers. At naikwento sa akin ng team captain na si Jessa Dorok na ginagawa daw nila ito para tumaas ang energia ng kanyang pupulan sa kabilang panic naman. Tila ba parang nasa video ko sa bus ang kanilang atake para tumaas ang moral na kailangan nila bago ang laro. But all fan aside, Coach Jerry Yee demanded more straight attacks from his spike curls way. While Coach Mia Chuseco reminded the girls to give it all out. Huwag daw silang magpigil dahil kalaban lang daw ang manggigigil. Martin and Coach Hammer. Maraming salamat. Fatima Marias report on our players and how they, you know, Psych themselves up right before a game to get them to the level of energy that they want. Itong Benilde sound trip. Ay, may sound trip kaya si Coach Jerry Yee. Okay, nakita ko na umo po. Para sa Benilde ah. Mike Ago sits on the bench looking to check in. In a few moments. Ooh, service ace from Willin. Very impressed with the way that she's playing in season 99. Yeah. Very impressed with the way that she is uh, elevating her game. Okay. Willin will be taking a breather. It is Mike Ago. Checking in for the first time here in this match. Former NCAA MVP won it in season 97. But serve from Mike. Oh, that's over received. Tregalo. Para kay Jade. Medyo ayaw pang tanggapin ni Jade nung una on that uh, over-receiver. Alanganin so, alang siya kung ito, ito two hand tip niya. Yeah. But still, a gift is a gift. That's right. Good placing from Jade. Alright. Timeout Time muna. Timeout, JRU. Mula kay Coach Mia. Nakailang bigay tayo ng punto? Oh, wala pa silang ginagawa. Anong gagawin natin? Di ba? Basic. Taas natin bola. Set yung bola. Palo tayo. Iwas tayo sa blockers. Pero kung bigay tayo ng bigay ng putos, ano? Eh, di. Hindi natin kailangan kalaban. That's the most animated I've seen Coach Mia Chuseco. In a while. In a while, yeah. In a while. Usually, calmado yan, oh, But you know. a few reminders that uh, you want CSB to earn their yeah, points. Rotation error, misreceive, dalawang beses, isang service A. So, yeah. 
yung mga pwede mo nang i-eliminate from uh, them, mm. yung mga madadaling puntos, you, you want to take it away. Kung baga, ang gusto ni Coach Mia, labanan nyo. Ayan, palagan nyo. Itong Binion Lady Blazers. But again, JRU, that was not the response Coach Mia was looking for. And Micah continues to serve. Mike scored two points in the previous game. Hmm, Dayame! Oh, yan ang hinahanap ni Coach. Jerry Dayame! So finally, she gets a clean hit here. Ito, malinis yung pagkakapalo niya. Maganda yung buwela, you know. Kita mo agad dun sa angulo ng bola na dun sa sweet spot sa gitna. Saktong-sakto yung palo niya. Kaya mas may karga na maganda yung trajectory. Yeah. Kanina, puro malakas yung atake niya. Mm, Panay happy birthday yung tinatahan. Kasi yun yung term nila, di ba? Pagpalobo yung okay. bola. Parang happy birthday. <laughs> Ayan, dalawang sunod para sa JRU. Bear scramble from the Lady Blazers. Overreceived by Estenzo. Yeah. Ano, ginawa na lang ng paraan yun ni Pasarte at ni Hentapa. So, Cherish Dayame continues to serve. Pasarte. The push will not work. Over to Hentapa. Lalong isip with a pop-up. Ruiz! Down the line. Micah was there for defense. And Tapa, too strong. Masyado malakas. But that goes out. So, JR here is able to chip bombers. away here. Three straight points. It is down to five. Pero ang oh, problema, nakapuhunan na ng maaga kanina yung binild. It's probably the longest run of the match for JRU. Dayame, good serve again. Mike's with a better reception. Oh, Zam will be activated. Automatic, almost yeah. automatic. Parang ATM tong gitna ng CSP. Like, for the percentages that they went there, yeah. one, oh, one an estimate, siguro mga 80%, nakakuha sila ng either a production or a yeah. very good next ball sa service case. Unfair na yun, no? Pagkaganun pa, yeah. magkaganun pa siya ka. Ka-efficient when it comes to spiking. Effective sa harap. Oh, pati service. Pati sa serve, effective. Happy naman si Zara Masko. Play inspired. I really like the way that she's playing today. So, Benio doubles up on JRU. Hirap na matchup, no? Hirap. Yeah. Uh, good. Real Play. Batara. Middle attack from Kring Batara in one motion. Laurente, Batara connecting. That's what we want to see from Kring. What a good first game of the season against Perpetual. Mm. Ah. Yep. Christy on Tangan. Again, the middles are activated by Basarte. Binibigyan niya ng kumpiyansa. Mukhang nagbasa ng Old Testament ng mga players ni Coach Jerry. Parang parting of the Red Sea every time. Gitna nila yung nata. Nakik-excuse me. Wala ko. Anong parte ng Old Testament yan? Yeah. Moses yan. Dumaan. Hindi lang si Moses manalili. Ah. Dumaan ah. sa gitna. Ah. Ah. Katarig. Clydel Katarig. There you go. Rookie from Cebu produces. We go to our second technical timeout. Benio, ahead technical by eight. Timeout. Good job ang isang Pinay weightlifter na nag-qualify sa 2024 Paris Olympics. Si Rosie Ramos na ang ikapitong pambato ng Pilipinas sa Paris. Nakuha niyang slot matapos manalo sa women's 49kg category sa Olympic Qualifying Tournament ng International Weightlifting Federation sa Phuket, Thailand. Tubong Sambuanga City, ang 20-year-old weightlifter na pinsan ng Olympic gold medalist. Na... Balik sa ating laban, it is 16 to 8 for the Lady Blazers. Let's check out our tournament format, Coach Hammer. Single round robin, top four teams will advance to the final four. Of course, the number one and number two seed will be enjoying a twice to bay a beat advantage over the number three and number four seed. One will go up against number four, number two will go up against number three. 
finals is the best of three date. But of course, if a team sweeps, they would be automatically seeded in the finals and step ladder tayo. Yeah. Number four will go up against number three. The winner will go up against number two. And then the winners will go to the finals. Winner lang pala. Yeah. The last bullet point, yun po yung nangyari for the past two seasons. Sa NCAA volleyball will be nailed, sweeping the elimination round in season 97 and 98. Mayor Ruiz with a put down. Limang puntos para kay Ruiz. All from attack score. Yup. Lagyan natin ang adjective. All from loaded, loaded attacks. attacks. That's right. That was probably her cleanest attempt though. Mm -hmm, true. Diba? Kasi walang kumarang sa kanya. Saka medyo naging shy yung back row defense yeah. ng Binil. Ruiz again! Cross court this time! Oh, there, there you go. go. Wow. Chill lang si Coach kanina pa eh. Titignan ko siya kanina, you know. Have you, have you seen Coach Jerry Lucid? In any game? In that game, I didn't see that. Oh, that was the latter part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. part. That, that part. was in, in the middle though. Mm -hmm. That was in, in, the, in the middle. <laughs> That's a rare instance. Oh. Ganda ng reception ni Mikes. Katarig! There you go. With the Check attack. Line, Pangalawang puntos ni Katarig sa laban natin. She was not inserted against San Beda. So this is her first taste of the in season 99. And in her NCAA career. So everyone from the roster has played. Yep, Apostol is the last one. Oh. So umayis pa. Si Corina. Corina Apostol. Oh, this lady can score. We've seen it in the past. Heavy hitter din. Mm -hmm. Heavy hitter. Not as uh, vertically gifted, pero ang lakas po malo. Eh. Right. At si mag-serve. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Nahirapan doon si Alonia. Tayami. Getigan. Tego to Mike's. Mike go. Oh. It's a point, but it's off an error of the Lady Bombers. How about this? Mike's with the approach. Ayun. Bagyang bagyang. How about JRU? How about JRU? Calling for time. Masyado kayong stiff sa laro. I-enjoy nyo naman yung game. Nakakapuntos naman kayo eh. Masyado kayong gigil. Masyado walang kumukuha ng pasa. Importante yung pasa sa game. Tapos tibayan nyo yung defense nyo. Hindi yung nagtitinginan kayo. Tsaka dahi. Huwag mo lapit sa net. Kasi pag malapit sa net yung set mo, dudukutin lang nila. Para makadiskarte yung spiders mo. Go tayo sa laban. Instructions from former Queen Bomber Dali Verzosa, who now serves as one of the assistants of JRU squad. And you see Coach Mia after Proud Eyes, huh? Oh, nga eh. Proud Eyes, huh? So, Succession plan? Pwede. Wow. Pwede. It was Dali who oh. took over that timeout. And very, tama naman eh. very clear instructions na if you're going up against taller blockers na so yeah. you want to give a little bit more buelo. Discansa. Oh, oh. discansa. Di inabutan ni Ondahan. That was too high Bombers. even for her. 11 to 19 is the tally. Christy just unable to get to the ball. Magisimula si Meruiz. Kagadong sir, derecho sa net. Sir, ay, ay, ay. Point goes to Lady Blazers. Christian Dangan will start on the other side. It's a nine point lead once again. Serving four. For the back to back defending champs. They have won 31 straight games in the NCAA. Let us remind everybody of that. <laughs> it's a long streak. They haven't lost since 2019. Mike ago. Too strong for Mike's. That goes out. Not trying to go cross court. Hindi pa rin ako ni Mike yung kanyang timing. But you can only get it through reps. Yeah. Yun lang talaga. Serving for GRU is Nicole And this is some quality game action. She is being served here to get her back on track. And in top form, Pasarte. Underhands it to Kasarig. How about the rookie today? Good adjustment here 
on that hit. And reading that defense solidly. Yeah. So kanilang uh, backup setter si Basarte. Another gem from Cebu. Mm. Diana. Anticipated. One more time for Cherish Diana. Basarte to Zap. Inabutan. Nabitin. Diana ulit. Uh, easy up for Corinne. Pike ago. Mm. Ruiz was right there at the back. Indai took a risk. Go again. Man, I get her. And touch on JRU. Second time in this set for JRU to get an error there on the net touch. It seemed attacking him a ago. Yon. Na ako na kay Mike. Twenty two thirty. Na hawa. Ten point lead for Benyud. Oh, service ace from Katarinis. My goodness. Grabe yung mga players ni Coach. Teka. Teka me. There you go. One of the cleaner hits. Go! Pinabutan. Tackle hit. Get Tegan. No, let's go! Sends it away. It is a point for Benilde. Always online on a Sunday, you know? Again, going to that middle. Yeah. So, you can see the percentage of the attack in the middle of the middle for this game. Because if you're a coach and scouting against Benilde, yeah, yeah. this is a different facet of their game. Because Gail Pascual and Hentapa, that's the most important thing that they've been able to Even in their previous game, they've been able to get puntos. Correct. It looks so efficient from that middle today. Go! Nope. There go to Dayame. Oh, sent back. Right back. Ruiz will try. Easy up. Shazam. Mikes is able to score. And she finishes set number two, 25 to 12. Micah's first point of, of the match came at the tail well. end of set number two. What a performance for the Lady Blazers. Another dominating set for them, 25 to 12. We'll be back after a few reminders.